Hello everybody, welcome back to a new video. In today's video, I'm going to show you the Grocery Guru badge in my Grave Dinner in the Robo Junk City map. Let's get started. So in order to get to this badge, you want to follow where I go right over here. Now once you reach the supermarket right over here, if you don't have this area unlocked yet, you will actually need 160 food pieces to actually get to this area. So if you don't have 160, you can find them pretty much anywhere around the map, but once you get at least 160, you should be able to unlock this area and enter it right over here. So once you unlock it, you can go ahead through the doors and enter the supermarket. So once you're in the supermarket right over here, you want to enter into this blue room that's right in front of you, and then you want to make your way to the back of this room right over there. And once you make way to the back of the room right over here, there should be this little side room with this little robot on the side over here. So once you find this robot, you want to speak to him and he will basically give you a little task over here. So he basically asks you to get some items and put them in the shopping cart and then bring them back to the truck right over here. And then once you do that a couple of times, he will award you with something. So right over here, this is what it's asking you and you want to bring the shopping cart right over here into this truck. So we're looking for one lettuce piece and one carrot. And it is kind of hard to move these shopping carts, so you just want to basically just push them kind of close to the door so you don't have to do that later on. So you just kind of want to bounce them in the general direction of where you want to put them so that it's easier to put them in the truck later on right over there. So for the lettuce piece right over here on the right side, it should be right over here next to the carrots and you can only hold one item at a time so you just want to pick it up and bring it over to the shopping cart. So once you're next to the shopping cart, you want to basically just kind of hop near it so it goes inside and then once it's inside, it should have a marked right over there. So now you can go back and get the carrot that you missed right next to the lettuce right over there as well. So once you get the carrot, you can bring it back to the shopping cart that you already have the lettuce piece in. So once you're able to place both of these in here, now you can push it back to the truck right over there that's in the room that you were just getting your mission and once you bring the shopping cart close up it will open up right over here and they can push a shopping cart in and then they'll give you a new order so you basically just want to repeat this process a couple of times until you do have no more orders left so for these next ones you want to get a melon and a little soda cup so for the melon they are right over here just where you got the lettuce and carrot on the right side once again so you just want to pick one up right over here and then put it in a shopping cart and for the soda cups they are right over here as well on the left side of this freezer section so once you get one of these you can bring it over to the shopping cart as well. And once you have all of these in the shopping cart, now you can push it back to the truck driver once again. So over here, once you get it next to the truck, you can push it inside and you should have a new order right over here with meat and fish. So for the meat and fish, they're both in the same section once again. You want to turn to the right and head over to the freezer section. Then right over here in the front of it should be the fish, so you want to just take it and then place it in one of the shopping carts. So right over here, once it is in the shopping cart, you can go back to the freezer section for the meat. And the meat is right behind the fish right over here on the shelf, so you just want to pick it up right over there and then bring it back over to the shopping cart once again. So once you have both of these in the shopping cart, now you can push it back to the truck once again. And then right over here, you can push it in the truck and you should have another order with this soda cup once again. So you can just get one from the same section that you got earlier, right over there, and then put it in a shopping cart. So right over there, once you got it in the shopping cart, you can put it back in the truck once again. And now you have a new order with the fish once again, but we also have a tire this time. So for the fish, you already know where that is. It's right over here in the freezer section, right at the front once again. So you can pick this up and put it in a shopping cart. Now for the tires, they're actually on the left side of the store. So right on the opposite side of the freezer section, there should be the tires right over here on the shelf. So once you do find one right over here, you can pick it up and then bring it over to the shopping cart once again. So once you have both items in the cart right over here, you can push it back to the truck once again. So right over here, you can push that in the truck now. And then once you get all of the quests done, this should be the message that you have right over here. So right over here, you can go back to the robot that you spoke to at the beginning and then he'll thank you for your work right over there. And then right over here for the parties, you will get a microwave dinner. So once you do all of those tasks, you should be able to get the microwave dinner over here. So once you do find it, you can go ahead and touch it and you should get the grocery guru badge. So yeah, that's much video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed and I will see you guys next time. Bye!